Wow. 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 Ugh. Boss fight. Get him. Ugh. Wow. Wow. Oh my god. Holy guacamole. Ugh. Can you stop? Ah! Need more energy. Could you run faster? Oh, wow, 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 wow. Shoot him! He always has a shield. Take this! Ah! Oh my god. <laughs> wow. Oh la la. That was intense. But fun. Nice battle. Liked it. So was that uh what the hell was that thing? This must be where they fed on everyone. Okay, but this was then no Wendigo, right? That doesn't. Uh, I just, I just, it doesn't look even like it's feeding on people like like this. And Wendigos, we saw the statues, and from what we know, they are. More humanoid and uh, less ghost shaped. I imagine. Hmm. So, did the government, the Astro guys, know of this place? And am I supposed to go here? And feed people? Actively fed people to whatever was down here? Who did they feed then? They can't just feed the staff like like every day another staff member. That that has to come up sometime. The bomb. It's only the beginning. Imagine oh. a weapon of mass destruction without the structural damage incurred. By extrapolating the mechanics of the leaf suit's god hand to a larger scale, I have devised a weapon capable of stripping all life from cities, even entire nations when used with the life seed. Oh. The Thanatos cannon will be the optimal super oh. weapon, rendering all others obsolete. These bombs we're all competing to produce will look paltry in comparison. That must be the weapon which Nia planned on using. Wait, what? But that would actually be a very, very terrifying concept of a bomb. A clean atomic bomb, so to speak, kind of. Just taking life of everything, but leaving everything structural completely intact. Oh, wow. Open up a little faster. Quantum research authorized personal only. <laughs> we'll see about that. Let me in. August 16th, yep. You knew about this the entire time, didn't you? Please. How could you? They're living creatures. You have no idea what's at stake here. They're embryos. The orbs you've been using are demon eggs. What you're doing here is... Oh. 
from every orb I collected. Oh, the demons. Uh, demons. Met Damon become these ghosts. The boss I just fought was once a little Matt Damon. Huh. Do they become that because of people? Because of what what the the researchers did here? Did they create them then? We allowed them access into the Astra facility during their night of attack. Admittedly, their plan was rather genius. Since Astra and Soma are linked, they intended to fire the Thanatos cannon connected to Astra's thermal storage at the Soma facility's energy reservoir to create a feedback loop of amplifying intensity until the system blows out. Not unlike a microphone to a speaker. I can finish what Virginia started. Create a feedback loop. Of course, I know how to do. <laughs> like in reality, wouldn't you be completely fucked now? Create a feedback loop. Yeah, yeah, sure. Of course. The only thing, ah, place the life seed. Of course. The life seed from the soma reactor necessary for the amplification, thus creating a harmless feedback loop when they attempted to fire Thanatos. Without the life seed, their plan was doomed to fail from the beginning. I will not tolerate any more disruptions. We have lost too much ground to Manhattan. Operations will resume exponentially. If the orbs will not suffice, then we'll use the damn valley itself. Dude, you need to calm down. Okay. Mm. Uh oh. Oh, we're going up. Amplified feedback loop, just like blowing out a speaker. Fire thunders towards the Soma energy reservoir. Okay, so that opens. And I'm gonna go in there. Move left and right to aim. Then thus cannon. I guess. Kaboosh. Man, I I was running on water, you know. You told me that was what I could do. Okay. Maybe. Is that the exit corridor? I don't. Uh -oh. Ah, hey man, don't have time for you. I shouldn't even look at him. Not even dealing with you, buddy. Ooh. 
Need more speed. What? M M M. Going there then. Taking this way. Totally this way. Oi, mate. You need to run faster, mate. Shut up. Hey, shut up, I said. Shut up, I said. Since when again do you need three times? God damn it, stop closing doors! Uh, Fish's office. Got a feeling you will be forgotten, dude. And uh oh, uh oh, ow. Get to the ah! magnet. Going up, not down. Left or right, left or right, left or right. Doesn't matter. Ah! Bam, 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 bam. ah! Can you stop just driving into me every time? Going this way. Speed. Go oh. Uh. What? Uh oh. What? Huh. <laughs> Good thing that it'll always just exactly the distance I need. Coming out! have been life power because they are life forms all along and with the combined power of Thanatos and the Brahma Astroborn, the power to control the world will lie within the hands of a small few. Every nation on earth will tremble. Huh. Bury everything that happens here. The valley will have to recover. Bye bye. And that has been Valley Blue Isle Studios development team. They did a great fucking great job on that game. I enjoyed it so much and it came out of nowhere I didn't even 
hear of it before. Found it one day on Steam. Instantly loving it. Just telling its own nice story, created its own little world in the existing world. And running around in these facilities, in these abandoned facilities, perceiving the past through the voice messages and text messages, that was a great way to deliver a story. With just the, the mad demons and the ghosts left. So what I didn't get are the ghosts now the things responsible for for the death of so many for the blood bloodbath or where is an actual wendigos that we did not meet in the game that is a little open that i i didn't quite understand But again, then it would, it would have been more like a horror game when there were actual zombie-like wendigos, crazy people. The moment when the boss came. <laughs> that, that, that was intense and the boss battle itself was, was pretty awesome. The moment when it came, all the roaring... And I was just looking around where where is the huge giant coming from now? But then it was just a ghost. A huge fucking scary ghost though. But not too scary. Everything very fitting here. Well, yeah, that is it. You see, I enjoyed this game very much. I strongly recommend it. If you uh, feel the need to play something like that, now you that, that you know the story and know how it goes out. But if you do, try it out. Ah, the door with the medallions, the 40 medallions. Damn. I sure would like to know what is behind that. I sure would like. Oh, the boss art, cool. I guess there would only be an uh, upgrade or something. Not necessary for the story. Behind that door. But maybe, maybe there would be a, a hint on on what these ghosts are, or if they are Wendy ghosts now. So, something to clarify that that last piece of the story. <sighs> but I guess I'm not gonna find out because yeah, collecting forty more medallions. Not sure, I'm not gonna take my time for that. I'm just gonna go with the experience I had with this game. I hope you had a little bit of fun as well. If you did, leave a like and I'd be happy to see you in the next video. Have a nice one. Zevus. This way. Something was there, read a flyer. Welcome to Atlantic Island Park, when I first came to visit our West Clark. That's too much to read, I don't... Hey, boy!